Hello everybody, and in today's tutorial we're going to be setting up uh, the plugin called Broken Link Checker. Now the reason why this plugin is so important to set up is because you want to make sure that all of the links on your website are currently active and working. Um, and this is especially not only good for user experience because you want your users to click on links that are actually working, but it's also good for SEO as well because when uh, the Google crawlers visit your website they follow every single link on your site so if any of your links lead to a 404 page which means an error on your website then what that does is it reduces your rankings because Google can't properly crawl your site if it's constantly hitting errors so basically you want to keep all the links on your site active so we're gonna go through how to install this plugin how to set it up really quickly so the first thing you want to do is is you want to head over to your your WordPress dashboard and you want to go over to plugins and you want to click add new So then you want to go over here, you want to type in broken link checker, hit enter. Okay, now it's over here. So you want to click install now. And hit activate. Okay. And then uh the second plugin will be installed, so then we want to look for it. We go over here to Tools, Broken Links. Click the link. Okay, so right now it says no broken links found. So what a uh, plugin needs is it needs some time to simply just go through um, the links and find out which ones are broken. But right now, um, according to my site, there are no broken links found, and you can see all the links on my site currently. Uh, it lists all the links. So, so far all my links are working properly. As you can see, because I use this tool all the time and sometimes I uninstall it, but uh, so far all my links are working. It says 370 detected links, no broken, no warning, no redux, and no to missed. So basically what you want to do is, if you have a broken link, it'll say something over here. And what you want to do is, is you don't see it right now because all my links are currently active. But uh, it'll give you a couple options, and what you can do is, is, let's say, assume this link is broken, you can just easily click unlink, right? So you want to like first, for instance, we have this link here. You want to click open and tab. So for instance, this link was broken. Okay, so it's working, right? So that's good. But if it was broken, then you would just hit the unlink button, and that would remove the link from all posts. Or if you know the proper URL, you can just hit, simply hit edit URL, change the URL to the working URL, and that's another way to fix the link. Or if you think the link is currently working, but maybe there's like an error in the plugin, then you just click recheck and it'll simply send the link back into the queue. So that's about it, guys. You know, really, really great plugin to have. Uh, you want to make sure all your links are up to date. Um, I use this plugin all the time. It's one of the must have plugins you have. Just make sure you go through all your links. Okay, see. Actually, it's going through. It's found a broken link. So let's see which link this is. Okay, perfect. So it has iWriters form. So I just want to quickly check the link myself. Okay, see, the site can't be reached. So then I want to go back. I simply want to just unlink. Well, cool. this removes the link. So anytime you get like a server not found or error, uh, a 404 not found page or anything like that, you simply just want to unlink it usually if you can't find the website so that's about it guys just basically check your links uh, you know at least once a week something like that and uh, unlink them to fix it or if you need to you can change your URL so that's it for this tutorial please subscribe if you enjoyed this I'm gonna be posting more tutorials soon and uh, if you have any questions or comments just leave them um, in the comments section below and I'll be sure to reply to you okay thank you thanks for watching bye bye